Previously, I've talked about the hurt and the damage that can be caused when you hold on to secrets. So we're going to be tapping for releasing the need to hold on to secrets and creating a level of self-acceptance. Please check out that video if you haven't already. But for now, let's jump in. Tapping on the karate chop point. Even though I've got to keep this a secret. I choose to love myself, honor myself and accept myself anyway. Even though I'm desperate to keep these things a secret. But the secrets keep building. I choose to love myself, honor myself and accept myself anyway. Even though I really need to keep these things a secret. I'm way too scared to tell anyone about it. I choose to love myself, honor myself, and forgive myself anyway. And tapping through any of the points at your own pace, I have to keep it a secret or they'll judge me. They'll reject me. They'll abandon me. I have to keep these, these things a secret. But the secrets keep building. More and more secrets that I keep holding on. And it's causing me so much pain. And I can feel it in my body. All this anxiety in my body. All this pain in my body. I can feel the anxiety and it hurts so much. The stress, the fear, the tension. Okay, and tapping on the back of the hand on the gamut point. So that's between the little finger and the ring finger. And I surrender all these thoughts and feelings to the highest energy for my greater good and the greater good of all those around me. Okay, so tapping on the karate chop point again. Even though I'm desperate to hold these secrets in because I'm afraid people won't accept me if they find out. I choose to love myself, honor myself and accept myself anyway. Even though there's no way I could tell anyone these things, it would be too shameful too embarrassing, way too hard. I choose to love myself, honor myself and accept myself anyway. Even though there's no way I could share this with anyone, they would judge me or they'd feel sorry for me or they'd condemn me or they'd reject me. I choose to love myself, honor myself and accept myself anyway. Tapping through any of the points at your own pace, all of this pain that I'm holding on to, I want to be free from it. I want to release it from my, my body. I want to release it from my subconscious programming. This need to hold on to secrets, this fear of being rejected, this fear of being abandoned, this fear of not being accepted, this fear of being outcast, this fear of being shamed, humiliated publicly. I release and let go of these fears. I don't need to hold on to them anymore. It's safe to let it go. It's an old programming that I don't need and I'm ready and willing to let it go. And tapping on the back of the hand on the gamut point, and I surrender all these thoughts and feelings to the highest energy for my greater good and the greater good of all those around me. Okay, tapping on the karate chop point. Even though I'm scared that people won't accept me for all the crazy things that I've done or for all the terrible things that I've gone through, I choose to love myself, honor myself and accept myself anyway. Even though I'm so scared of people hurting me, judging me and condemning me 
or feeling sorry for me. I choose to love myself, honor myself and accept myself anyway. Even though I want to let go of all this pain and yet I still feel a little bit trapped by it, I choose to love myself, honor myself and accept myself anyway. And tapping through any of the points at your own pace. I'm, I want to be accepted. I want to accept myself. But how can I accept myself when I've been through all these things? When I've made all these terrible decisions? When people have hurt me in this way? Or when I have hurt others in this way? How can I accept myself? I want to accept myself. I am open to accepting myself. I am ready and willing to accept myself because I know that's a powerful place to be. And I know that would give me so much freedom. So I'm going to do this tapping every day where I keep tapping on myself, allowing myself to feel self-acceptance, to feel love to feel love for myself and to feel love for others. And tapping on the back of the hand on the gamut point and I surrender all these thoughts and feelings to the highest energy for my greater good and the greater good of all those around me. Okay, and now just tapping at your own pace through any of the points. It's safe to let go of the shame it's safe to let go of all the fear. It's safe to let go of all the judgment. I'm open to loving myself. I'm open to accepting myself. I'm open to trusting myself. I'm open to believing in myself. I'm open to honoring who I am, honoring all that I am. I'm open to accepting all parts of me, even the worst parts, even the most despicable parts, even the parts that I don't want anyone else to see. I'm open to honoring all parts of me. Okay, I'm tapping again on the back of the hand and I surrender all these thoughts and feelings to the highest energy for my greater good and the greater good of all those around me. Okay, stretching up to the sky. Nice deep breath in, inhale, and then relax and just shake it all out. So shake it out in your fingers and your toes and really move the energy in your body. So you allow the energy psychology to shift into your physical body faster. I hope this has helped. Please repeat the tapping. Leave me a note in the comments if there's anything, any clarification that you want or if there's any further tapping that you would like from this. Sending you so much love and light on your journey. Bye for now.